welcome to our show. I am Gwen Kedalia. And this is Emmanuel. And for today's video, we have a fascinating topic to discuss. Electromagnetism. But what exactly is electromagnetism? To help us understand, we have our special guest for today's episode. We have Mika Bakar, Carl Coronel, Farley Olama, and Joseph Salarga. These are the students from Section Picasso under the Hume Strand. Thank you for having us on this show. It's a pleasure to be here. You're welcome, Ms. Bakar. And thank you for accepting our invitation to join us. And I hope you guys are having fun. Alright, let's begin our discussion. Joseph, could you explain to us what electromagnetism is in simple terms? Sure thing. Electromagnetism is a subfield of physics that investigates the interaction of electrically, electrically charged particles with magnetic and electric fields. It explains how this effect Interactions between electrically charged particles like protons and electrons. Electric motors, generators, transformers, and telecommunications are all supported by the underlying natural force of magnetism. However, it is an important area of research in physics in its crucial for comprehending how matter and energy behave in the universe. As a whole. That's interesting, Joseph. Thank you for your explanation. Mika, can you give us an example of how these forces can interact with each other? Of course, assume you have a wire carrying an electric current. A magnetic field is operated around the wire by the current. The foundation of electromagnetism is the idea of electric charge, which is a basic characteristic of matter. Positive and negative electric charges can with one another like charges repel one another while offering charges attract the another. Wow, that's really cool. Thanks for the explanation, Mika. We'll take a quick break right now, but don't go anywhere. We have more exciting content to discuss about electromagnetism lined up for you when we return. Stay tuned. And people think I'm nuts. Always there in crunch time. The new 500S. Tested for bad boys. And now we're back to our show. Let's move on together to another question. Carl, how does electromagnetism apply in our daily lives? It is extremely important in our daily life. Electromagnetism, for example, is used by motors in our gadgets and vehicles to turn electrical energy into mechanical energy, allowing them to move it also serve as the foundation for the technology found in our phone, laptop, and other electrical gadgets. That's amazing, Carl. It seems like electromagnetism is all around us. Another question, Carl. Are there any other interesting applications of electromagnetism? Yes, there are plenty. Electromagnetism is utilized in medical technology to provide detailed pictures of our inside organs, such as MRI equipment. It is also employed in power generation and transmission, allowing us to create and distribute power across large distance. It is, it's even employed in the study of the cosmos 
to help us comprehend how stars and galaxies behave. What an excellent answer you got there, Carl. And now for the last question, Janaya, are there any famous scientists who have contributed to our understanding of what electromagnetism is? Absolutely. James Clerk Maxwell is well-known scientist who contributed to our understanding of electromagnetism. Maxwell's equation, which are the cornerstone of contemporary electromagnetism, were created by him. They explain the behavior of electric and magnetic fields. Well, it looks like we can't escape the effects of electromagnetism. Thank you everyone for explaining this fascinating topic to us today. And that's all for today's episode of our talk show. We hope you enjoyed the conversation and gained some valuable insights about electromagnetism. Stay tuned for more thought-provoking discussions and engaging guests in the future. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share our show with your friends and families. Thank you for joining us and we'll see you next time.